talk about um, important information for your next visit to um, the home of the Citizen Land Park, where the goal is a world-class ballpark with a world-class service, as stated in the employee manual. So, just some quick background, um, some quick facts about the stadium. It opened on April 3rd in 2004, so we're coming up on the 10th anniversary. Um, it's sponsored by Citizens Bank which is a bank that serves those in the uh, Middle Atlantic, Northeast, and Midwest regions of the U.S. It has hosted uh, two World Series, uh, one in 2008, which the Phillies won, and in 2009, the Phillies lost to the New York Yankees. Uh, the capacity of the stadium is 3,659 people. Uh, it has the largest video display in the National League. It features a neon Liberty Bell that swings and rings after each Phillies home run. And it's also home to Ashburn Alley, which is the stretch of the main concourse from right field to left center field. So, first thing after probably buying the ticket is how to get to the ballpark. So, for those driving, the address would be one system bank way in Philadelphia, PA. It has easy uh, highway and public transportation access, and easy access um, <coughs> since it is located in the sports complex in Philadelphia. So. For those driving, um, there's 21,000 spaces available in the sports complex. Uh, it's conveniently located in between both I-76 and I-95. And SEPTA, which is Philadelphia's uh, public transportation system, uh, runs buses and a subway along Broad Street. And after arriving, probably the first thing you'll wonder is, where's your seat? So, all 100 level sections uh, directly surround the field. Um, and that's the closest that you can get. The next tier above uh, is the 200 level seats, which also encircle the entire field. Um, and above that is the 300 level section, which runs from the left field foul line and around home plate to right field. And then lastly, the highest tier is the 400 level, which, is, um, which runs from the left field uh, foul line and around home and to first base. So after finding your seat and watching the game for a couple of innings, the enticing smells of the food uh, might get to you. So the options that are special to Citizen Bank Park are Bulls Barbecue, uh, Harry the Caves, Tony Luke's, uh, McFadden's, and Shakey's and Pete's. So to give you a visual, um, uh, beginning in the alley in right field is Bulls Barbecue which is named after Greg uh, Lazinski, a former Phillies player, whose nickname was The Bull, and it serves freshly made barbecue on a daily basis. Uh, next to Bulls, uh, in the alley in right field, is Chickies and Pete's, who serves their widely known crab fries and their signature uh, cheese dipping sauce. Um, and last on the alley, <coughs> going towards left field, uh, is Tony Luke's, and this is where fans can get their fill of traditional Philly cheesesteaks uh, within the ballpark. Uh, moving into left field, under the scoreboard, is Harry the Case, which is a bar and grill where fans can both eat and watch the game simultaneously. And then, finally, uh, at the third base gate is McFadden's Restaurant, which is another bar and grill uh, for fans to enjoy. So, after getting your food and probably returning to your seat, uh, you'll probably get to see the Phillies up by a lot and <laughs> probably wanting to see some of the attractions in the stadium. So for uh, merchandise, uh, fans can go to either the Majestic Clubhouse store or the uh, Mitchell and Ness Alley store. And one important thing to note about Citizens Bank Park, as Jamie Trout, the director of marketing services, says, uh, Citizens Bank Park is first and foremost a family-oriented atmosphere. This is why for amusement at the ballpark, um, there is uh, run the bases, the fun zone, and fan trade for fans of all ages. So, also help you locate the <coughs> beginning at third base gate is the Majestic Store, which specializes in all the on field gear and official gear of the team and other gifts as well. Along the first base side of the concourse at the first base gate is the fun zone, which is a huge playground for kids. <coughs> Out in the alley, uh, next to Bulls Barbecue, are both run bases and fan trivia. And run bases 
is basically a game uh, for kids where they can simulate running around the bases and um, while running in place. And fan trivia is for fans of all ages to guess their favorite Phillies trivia. Um, <coughs> and moving um, down the alley um, is the Mitchell Ness store, which fans can um, purchase retro gear and other novelties. And so, to conclude, hopefully, um, this information will help you for your next visit to Sissy Plane Park.